Ring in the new year with amazing savings from Appalachian Wireless. Get the Galaxy S7 for just $49.99 when you sign or renew a two-year service agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. The girls and boys 15th Region All-A Classic Championship took place tonight at the East Kentucky Expo Center. And by the end of the night, two teams will be able to call themselves champions. First up is the defending 15th Region champions, the Shelby Valley Lady Cats and the Paintsville Tigers. Slow start for the Wildcats, only scoring 11 points in the first half. And they have some making up to do. Picking up in the fourth quarter, Paintsville dominating this one. Presley Chirico putting in the work and getting the results. She racked up 12 points, leading all scorers on the night. Cassie Rowe would knock one in from the top of the key, but that's where they struggled tonight was from the perimeter, only hitting three of 26 attempts, but they couldn't climb back to the top, and the Tigers would take this one back to Johnson County. Final score of the night, Paintsville 43, Shelby Valley 30, as the Lady Tigers advance to the All-A State Championship for the first time since 2014. In the nightcap, two teams, one title in which neither team has won. It was Sheldon Clark and Eastridge in the boys' 15th region All-A Classic Championship. The Cardinals coming out strong with no sign of slowing down in the first quarter, racking up 12 points before the Warriors would put any on the board. Dangerous inside and out with three back-to-back three-point baskets coming from Dylan James and David Contrell. The Warriors finding themselves in a hole, but they would slowly dig their way out. Chris Bevins puts Eastridge on the board finally with around five to go in the first quarter, but that's when it all picked up. Matt Miller for two, Warriors only trailing by two going into the half. The battle starts now with just two quarters to play. The Warriors take their first lead of the game. Down low, Matt Miller scores, draws the foul, and the momentum is set. They would tie it at 44 after four quarters, and they went to overtime, and the Warriors prevailed. First time in school history, Eastridge is the 15th region All-A Classic champions by a final score of 48-45. to The All-A State Championship takes place January 25th through the 29th.